So a year ago, I decided that I'm going to do this no comb challenge. I think I invented the no comb challenge. The link for my first no comb challenge is in the description box below. This is my hair five months in without using any comb to comb my hair. All I do is finger detangle. So this is my hair five months into the challenge. Oh, hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. <laughs> now, this is my seven month length check update. I'm not using any comb to detangle my hair, just strictly finger detangle and these are the results my hair is not fully stretched may i add it's not fully stretched however it is blow dried i had my hair blow dried like a couple days before and this is the length of my hair now my complete hair routine guys everything that i've done to my hair every single thing i put in my hair every single style that i have done with my hair i have documented it and i have put it here on youtube so that you guys can benefit from it because i know the comments are going to be coming in saying okay Lori, what did you use to grow your hair what did you put in it what is your routine what did you not do what did you do guys every single thing that i have done to my hair i have documented it and it's here on my channel so you need to subscribe turn on that notification so that when i do post a video you guys are the first to see it my first no comb challenge the link is in the description bar below how i finger detangle my hair the link is also in the description bar below how i style my hair my most popular style my most go-to protective style and my most go-to low manipulation style is in the description bar below so i did not leave you guys out but yeah this is the length of my hair after seven months of not using a comb to comb my hair and i must admit that the texture of my hair i think changed my hair is a lot more thicker it's a lot more fuller oh my god look at that lead by the way my hair is stretched you guys it's not flat ironed as yet i'm going to flat iron it and i'm going to um show you guys the true okay, length so of it um, you guys all right so i'm gonna use the revlon you guys can see revlon wet to straight flat iron and I'm gonna go ahead and flat iron all of my hair because it's the end of the year and I'm gonna do something different and then that's it. So I'm gonna flat iron my hair. Unfortunately there are no folks where I am standing so I won't be able to do it on camera. So I'm gonna flat iron my hair and be right back. Okay so you guys are wondering what heat protecting agent I'll be using I'll be using my sweet almond butter and I mix that with my Essence JA herbal oil and that's what I'm going to use as my heat protectant. It's um, almond oil and it has a lot, the Essence JA has a lot of oils, about 10 oils and herbs to it. So I mix them all together and I'm going to use that as my heat protectant. So, so come back. all done so what you're looking at now is flat ironed hair on low heat oh my god it's been like forever since i used the comb it feels so weird but yeah so it's it's not um flat iron bone straight because i don't want the heat to my hair so it's semi straight but yeah this is the length of it yes hope you guys enjoyed this video give me a thumbs up if you do comment below if you have any questions and as always thank you so much so very very much for watching
will i be going back on the challenge yes but instead of seven months i'll be doing it every three months so every three months i will come back on and i will update you um about my growth no i will not be flat ironing my hair every three months i thought i'll blow dry my hair and let you guys see the length of it okay so it's december now so i'm back on it january february march and i'll check in april may june and then i'll come back and check in so it's every three months instead of seven months or six months okay